Welcome to Live from KIG, located at 220 South Peters Road, just up from Fantasy World. You know the address. September the 17th, cloudy day here on Rocky Top, 694-9788. If we can help you out in insurance in any way, car insurance, home, life, business, give us a call. Operator is standing by, Lisa. Me, me and Lisa are at the helm this morning. Terry is on vacation. Spencer is playing those uh, magnificent new greens at Avalon. As a joke, I've got a report that uh, they're a little hurt. They're rolling about a six on the stint meter down there at Avalon. Uh, but uh, hopefully they'll, what you say, Bill Vaughn? Um, last night, Rick Springfield, uh, we found Jesse's girl down there at the Tennessee Valley Fair. Um, if you want to feel good about yourself, just go to the fair this weekend. A lot of people uh, eating corn dogs, funnel cakes, riding those rides, or held on with two last washers. Uh, but anyway, a great concert. Uh, 72 years young. It's hard to believe that Rick Springfield is that old. Um, Todd Henderson with an early prediction. Uh, but anyway, he, he put on a great show, sang for about an hour and a half. A good time. Weather was perfect. Let's just jump right into it. The John, first, I don't know if it's first annual, but anyway, the Johnny Majors Classic. Got this for, from Second Harvest, uh, and it turned out to be a crying towel. Welcome in, John. Uh, you know, Tennessee goes down in defeat, 41 to 34. Overthrow Joe. You know, if we'd had a decent quarterback, uh, average quarterback, if you will, in the first half, anyway, we'd have been up 21 to nothing. Uh, but he, unfortunately, or fortunately, however you look at it, um, I am a working-class dog, Greg Hopkins. There's no question about it. Uh, if we'd had an average quarterback, we'd been up 21 to nothing. He got hurt. Hooker came in, moved the ball, uh, did well. We had a, a questionable third down play there in the fourth quarter that looked like a first down. We did review it. We go fourth down at about the size of this football, about a foot, and we don't go under center. Uh, that's the craziest thing. Uh, you're in the SEC. This isn't Central Florida. Uh, we line up under center. We can get a foot. If we can't, we don't deserve to win. And then they shank a punt. They give us another opportunity to tie the game. And uh, Hooker looks at uh, that uh, Be that as it may, the winner last week of the pick to score was Tim Chaney. I'll tag you in this. You know the address. Come by. Pick the score. Tennessee, there's no line on the game. Tennessee takes on the Golden Eagles of Tennessee Tech. Um, so pick the score. I'm going to say like 56-6 uh, to six is what I'm going to say, if they even score. Um, anyway, noon shootout again this week. Um, I'm not exactly sure what broadcast that's on, but I think it's SEC uh, Network. Maybe ESPN 3 or 4. It almost got to be. Um, let's see. So pick the score. We ran out of Regal, but their Regal is still open. $25 gift card. Come by and see us. You know the address. Have a Fun, safe, happy weekend. Next week there'll be a little touch of fall in the air. Um, eight. So we think we're gonna they're gonna get a safety on us. Greg Hopkins. Anyway, pick the score to win. Share the video. Have a great weekend.
Here's the score to win. Upside down. Brought to you by American Express. Don't leave home without it. No balls.